immigrating to the United States is a struggle since most are unaware of what to expect. However, the determination these people bring with them is what makes them stand out and accomplish great things. Every immigrant carries their own unique story, but none like Jesus Luviano. My name is Jesus Luviano. I am from Guadalajara, Michoacán, Mexico. I immigrated into the United States back in 2002 with my family and I arrived to what it would be now my life at Sanger. The reason why I wanted to come to the United States is because I wanted to continue with education. Unfortunately, education in Mexico, it's a little difficult for people who don't have the resources. So my family decided to bring me to the United States, hopefully to find some opportunities with my interest and possibly achieve a degree or some higher education for myself and be able to help my family. Coming to the United States was definitely a challenge. I didn't speak a single word of English, not even a sentence. I couldn't even say I couldn't speak English. So having to relate, having to adapt into a new community, into new faces, everything new for myself, it was definitely a shock. My life in education pretty much began at Singer High School. And I can say it was the biggest door for myself and my success at this point because I was very thankful to me, Mr. Chacon, who was my principal. He supported me and showed me care and guided me through all the right people at school. When I first started at Tinker High School, I started as a dancer, first of all, for the after school with the principal's lip sync, and then I became their, their choreographer. So it was around eight years that I served Mr. Chacon as a choreographer in Singer High School and the rest of the students. And then I also did uh, the cheer squad. I wanted to dance. I didn't care how, when, or what. I, I only was seeking for opportunities. I wanted to also do more sports. Unfortunately, I didn't have the time because when I first started at Singer High School, I didn't speak any English. So unfortunately, I, was, I had some limitations in to enjoy all the sports. After high school, I continued with my education. I started at Ripley College. I completed my general ed at Ridley College and then transferred to Fresno City to achieve another um, AA in recreational admin. And I'm still in the process of going into Fresno State. I started dance back when I was eight years old. Uh, professionally training, I started back when I was 14. So it's been ever since 14 years old that I've been in several companies around California. My current occupation, I am a program coordinator at Parlier High School. As a program coordinator, uh, my main duty is to oversee the program, um, create activities, bring any, any sort of activities that will allow our students to be connected with their culture. One of the main big events that I was able to put for Parlier High School was the, it was a fashion show. It was called Rock the Runway. Rock the Runway was a project put out together with professional designers, professional dancers, photographers, and other media that was invited. One of the main events that I'm planning for for the next year is um, several musicals, hopefully. I would like to begin with The Lion King and continuously I would like to do Dancing with the Stars. I would like to be able to showcase professional dancers from other companies, people that I have uh, met throughout my dance career, and hopefully um, a talent show as well, and several other, uh, other events. The best feeling that I get is it is definitely to see the students happy. It is the best reward of my job because that's my motivation. That's the reason why I chose to do this in my job. This is why I love this job because I can see that there is a lot of students that wish and hope to better themselves just the same exact way that I have done it or wanted to in the past years. Fresno V should feature our Parlier High School students because many of them are working really hard. They are all looking to be recognized, be inspired, and know that they have the support from our community. There is really no limits besides the ones you set for yourself. <laughs>